So this video is an update to part one, where I was using phrases and selecting from those at random to get the note delays within. And on that video, on YouTube, uh, someone left a comment which presented a much better version of this, which was using uh, columns within the phrase and selecting from those using the mutually exclusive maybe command Y00. Uh, they didn't get it working at first, but they eventually got there. And uh, there is a great advantage to this, which is, as you saw in the first part, it takes a long time to set up all of those 126 phrases. So this is much quicker. Uh, they suggested using 12 columns per phrase. Uh, I suggested using 8 because that actually makes it easier to set up. You would just make two, where you go from zero to seven, and then next phrase you go from eight to F, and then when you're duplicating phrases down here, you would just then need to run through each one and add one, 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 two, 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 two to the start of each phrase accordingly. And so that's what I've done here. Now, there's another couple of great advantages to doing it this way. The first is which uh, as I showed in part one, uh, you only have 126 phrases available because uh, value 00, 0 will give you no phrase and value 127 will give you key map mode. So uh, although I used uh, value 00, 0 uh, phrase being off to get a delay value of 00, 0, which gave me an extra value there, uh, I couldn't get value FF because of this. And doing it this way, you have available to you the full range of 00 to FF. And the second advantage is that you can do it in increments of 1. Whereas previously it was done in increments of 2 because of the limited amount of phrases available. And it all works great in this example. And it's set up in pretty much the same way as before with a couple of differences. We still have the destination of the LFO set to the instrument macros, phrase programs, selecting from the 20 that are available at random, frequency of 8 LPC and obviously using random mode. Now, because there are far less phrases to select from, the amplitude is 25% this time. We only want to grab from these and none of the empty ones, or phrase key map mode, or no phrase. And that's where the offset comes in. It's a rather strange value. Because this time you can't use no phrase for uh, value zero, 00 for the delay. That is because each phrase has eight different delay values within it, selected at random. So if you were to do that here for no phrase, that would have an eight times more likely chance of being selected compared to any other delay value. So you have to avoid this when it's being selected through the values here in the LFO. And also, you don't want to select any of the other values. So, although I knew exactly what the offset, well, I knew kind of what the offset value would be, so it was just a case of going up in small increments and finding out what the exact value was that would work for this. And it's 13.29% for whatever reason. And that's it. This works great. Uh, just like all the previous examples, this is available for download in the video description. I've actually stuck this in the part one download, and you can have access to both of them here. They're just in different instruments, and they play out in different tracks.